And from Yokel Studios to wine shops, new businesses are popping up across downtown Raleigh. Yeah, next week is the start of Triangle Small Business Week, highlighting the businesses that make the Triangle thrive. CBS 17's Gilat Milamid is downtown with how this week hopes to help business out. The courtyard is the yoga studio for now before Yoga 6 Glenwood South opens in the early summer, but even before officially opening. We have a lot of fun things planned next week for Small Business Week. The studio is participating in Triangle Small Business Week, which begins Sunday. Owner Amanda Villari says they will be hosting three events as part of the week, including free yoga here in the courtyard on Wednesday. It is definitely about exposure for all the small businesses. It's all about the support, support local, support all the entrepreneurs out there that are working their butts off every day and support the community coming back together. Raleigh Chamber VP of Marketing Mark Dinitz says the week isn't only about highlighting small businesses, but providing them with resources like how to apply for loans and networking opportunities. We want to show them that how important they are and provide those resources. And they're there. They might not know that they're there, so we want to make that aware. He says 80,000 people work for small businesses in the Triangle. So we've already brought on three new employees and plans to add even more. The Raleigh Wine Shop is one of eight new small businesses to open so far in 2022, according to the Downtown Raleigh Alliance. After 10 years of being a traditional retail shop on Glenwood Avenue, they expanded to a new location to host events, tastings, and serve some food. While they're not an official participant of Triangle Small Business Week, co-owner Seth Hoffman says... Anything that recognizes small, locally owned businesses, like we're super excited about, like, you know, rising tide raises all ships. Gilat Malamed, CBS 17 News.